How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the vlog. Join me today on an incredible adventure. <laughs> I'm about to head to Idaho, where there's these dudes called Grindhard Plumbing. They build Barbie Jeeps, they have a really rad Toyota Tacoma, and they do just cool stuff. They invited me out to come play, and in their own words, Toyota shenanigans. Do Toyota shenanigans. And there's a few other YouTube channels that are gonna be there, so it's just a really fun time for all of us YouTube folk to get together and make videos. So that's gonna be about a seven hour drive. I'm meeting Story Till Now in about two hours, and I'm already running late. So we gotta go, let's get out of here. Okay, I barely feel prepared for today. I don't feel prepared for today. This truck, the Raptor, has been having like this really bad vibration. I think that like one of the the weights fell off the wheel, the wheel weights fell off. So it's like a bouncing feeling. Feels like the thing's gonna rattle apart. And I had every intention of fixing it before I left, but it just didn't happen. It's been a pretty uneventful drive, which is how we like it. Especially when we're towing, uh, it's good to be uneventful. It's pretty snowy, but very wet and rainy and kind of nasty. But I'm about 10 minutes out from my first rendezvous point with Sean from Story Till Now. And um, from there, we're going to uh, convoy together. On a trip this long, it's it doesn't hurt to, uh, to pair up with somebody in case something does happen, so. Okay. All right, guys, we made it to the top of Snoqualmie Pass, and I'm with Sean from Story Till Now, the Story Till Now. Yeah. I keep skipping the part, okay. sorry. You know, uh, either or. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, dude, sick. You got a built Gladiator. Sweet, I had no idea what you were driving. Um, it's all I got. Sweet, don't break it. <laughs> Have you hung out with Ethan has, yet? I haven't, no. He has a way about him <laughs> that makes you. <laughs> I haven't met him, but I've seen all his videos. Oh, dude, these smart caps are sick. I want to get one for my uh, Tacoma. Yeah, not that awesome. one, but the other one. Those are cool. Let's show you what we do here. Yeah, sweet. We put one of the bins in here and that did like a full red arc that system. That is sick. Yeah, you know, the, the charging station what? for the drone. Oh no way. Yeah, that's legit. Take the the Mavic Three out for the maiden voyage this uh, this trip. Oh, so. that'd be cool to see. I've never seen one of those. Got your jackery all hot and ready, dude. Yeah. This is sick. Yeah, I would. Uh, pretty dialed. Yeah, these little like trips like this would probably be a lot easier for me if I had something set up like that. In the winter, it's the best because so there's a 200 amp hour lithium in here. Yeah. I, can, I run a heated blanket off of it. That's what everybody's doing. That's it's the new the thing. trend. It's, it's the like thing. a new thing. I uh, just realized that I forgot my even my buddy heater. So oh no, that's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I'll wear all my clothes. All the layers. All the layers. <laughs> all right, man. Well, it's warm out here. What are you talking about? It's like summer. It's not terribly <laughs> bad, honestly. I bought some gloves because I feel like we're gonna need them if we, somebody gets stuck. You got a winch? I'm sure yeah, you got a winch. Yeah, okay. got a winch. Mine doesn't have a winch, it doesn't have any armor. It is like nothing but a tiny little Tacoma it's all truck. on solid axles. Yeah, it's just truck. Double bob, so it's a so it's a limited cab. So wait, okay, it's a single cab frame with a that that was then bobbed, and then a double or a limited cab body that then bobbed the bed. <laughs> so the frame was bobbed and then the bed was bobbed. So it's super tiny. I, I feel like I'm like afraid to leave the snow, but we're gonna go to Idaho where the yeah. snow is gonna be like this deep. It's gonna be way worse. Can't wait. I mean better. It's gonna be yeah, better. It'll be way better, yeah. All right, thanks man, I'll see you there. <laughs> Let's go, on to the 
freeway. I actually really like this Raptor for towing. I think it's just that the F-150 in general though, the twin turbo does really well. The new re-gear, very, very nice. You put this bad boy in tow mode and it uses engine braking. It works really, really well. And what I really like is this little function right here. I'll show you. That is four-wheel drive automatic. So it's almost like all-wheel drive. So if a tire slips while I'm driving, boom, instantly, pop, bing, bop, bam, it goes into four-wheel drive. When I was there pulling on the highway, four-wheel drive, and then I just felt it disengage, and I'm cruising right along, no big deal. Very, very nice function to have. close very close guys we are about to arrive alive which is an accomplishment when uh, I'm driving it's not that I'm a bad driver I'm actually a, I think a pretty decent driver but I'm excited I mean these are super cool dudes super humble awesome dudes I mean I'm looking forward to hanging out with them we're only about 15 minutes away and uh, I hope it goes good Since we're driving at night and we're using our lights, let's take this opportunity to give a huge shout out to Heretic Studio, a sponsor of the channel and the sponsor of today's video. Thank you so much, Heretic, and thank you guys for watching. You can use my discount code MAX10 to save 10% on LED lights. And 10% doesn't seem like a lot, but man, they tax you this. Everything's built on 10%, right? Everything. If everybody saved 10%, it'd be like you weren't paying taxes. You're welcome. But that's it. Let's go wreck some shit. And uh, if I didn't give these shout outs, guys, there's no way I'd be able to afford to do any of this. Uh, I've never towed something like a vehicle through like a completely snowy road. I, I'm, to be honest, I put the Raptor in that four auto mode and it's just doing really, really good. I'm not gonna, I could go a lot faster, but I'm not going to. Luckily this new trailer, if you've been watching along, uh, I bought a new trailer recently. Somebody at the Walmart parking lot backed into my old trailer. It is repaired. I had it fully repaired. New brakes, new wiring, new leaf springs, new perches, <clears throat> and it's now for sale. So if you're looking for a toy hauler, it's a good crawler hauler trailer. Um, that's got mounts and stuff everywhere. I just don't need it because I bought this new one um, out of necessity, honestly, because I had to find it, so. Sorry, I lost track of what I was saying. This new trailer's brakes are impeccable. I mean, they are really, really good. I can stop almost faster with the trailer and a truck on it than I could normally. Man, this dude is out here and I'm towing. Slippery. Oh, well. So I was cruising up the hill. I was remarking on how uh, nicely the drive was going. And then I realized this is pure ice. You can't even walk on it. That it was, is amazing park. <laughs> yeah, like, I'd like to say I meant to do that, but I had no freaking control whatsoever. In fact, like I looked back, I was like, oh, we stopped. And I looked back and I, I was like, where's my, where's my trailer? I didn't even feel it go off this ledge. I feel like probably disconnecting it from the truck. Maybe it's gonna be the... Yeah, well, hopefully it stops here though. I don't want it to keep going. It's gonna live in there. Whoa. I almost went over the edge too. It is super slippery. Did your buddy get his truck up this? Did he tow? Am I the only one, am I the only idiot towing? Oh my gosh. Not a good way to start the trip at all. Yo, how's it going? Hey man, uh, it's going. You know you know how your driveway, it's it's real icy and steep? Yeah, the road? To yeah. My, yeah, the road before my driveway, yeah. Yeah, I almost made it to the top and then I started spinning and then I started sliding backwards and now my, my trailer with the, the Toyota is in the trees 
and the raptors oh, yeah but i somehow missed all the trees but um yeah we're like we're like si right. sideways on the road i'm gonna have to un right. unhitch i gotta strap the trailer to something so it doesn't slide and then i don't know what yeah, we're gonna do well, from there well uh clinton's here we're just hanging out drinking beer so we'll come down and uh help you out sweet <laughs> it's so slippery it's hard to even stand on the hill that's pretty slick um cool well do you have chains for your truck for your raptor at all no. What size tires? No. Okay. 35. Well, I have chains for my truck. I'm guessing that's actually the only truck that actually has chains because everybody else has tires that are too damn big. Yeah. Um, so maybe we'll grab Clinton's truck and mine just in case because I have chains so I can like hook up to your trailer afterward and actually tow it up. Um, but Clinton's got a winch and everything, so. Okay. We'll come, we'll, we'll come you know. Come rescue, rescue me. Thanks. No worries. <laughs> All right. Always an adventure. Always, jeez. See you. Careful coming down. Don't plow yeah. me. Quote <laughs> <laughs> of the night. Don't yeah. plow me. Don't plow me. Not today. <laughs> I think the play is to get your truck back here with this strap. Mine? Yeah, and get the spare tire off so that we don't hurt it. We'll let the neighbors get by and, and uh, you know, figure out the best plan, but yeah, we could totally get the Tesla. Off-road Tesla but... rescues douchebags. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? Is this one of those accidents? <laughs> <laughs> A literal old lady just drives across. Drives up at like nothing. nothing. <laughs> what, what, what do you have, a raptor? <laughs> <laughs> that was a Tahoe. <laughs> but, it's still fun to make fun of the raptor. I thought I heard studs. Anyone else heard studs? <laughs> I heard some studs. This guy's towing a trailer, so I can't even, now I can't uh, even say I mean, it was the trailer. He has a lawnmower on a trailer, so that's a big difference. It's not a fair comparison because your tread blocks are like, three square inches per tread block of yeah. perfectly yeah. smooth rubber. All right, let's figure out what the heck to do. It's so having done that, I do feel confident coming back down to winch it if we need to. Yeah, honestly, well, you, if you can ride field that field. ditch back down and get like right here. I am in shambles right now, the, the whole life. If it drives forward, then we just drive it off. Because once you get this tire here, you're laughing because you got lockers, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah, I don't know if the front works yet. I haven't tested it, but yeah. Okay, sweet. Cool. All right. Cool. That's the plan. Yeah. Whoever drives it can drive. Uh, whoever wants. I well, I'm gonna let I'm Max drive it because if anything happens, it's on him. I'm gonna film it. Fair enough. <laughs> I'm gonna. It's, so, and it's not that I think direct. something's gonna happen, but I just don't want to be that guy. <laughs> now we get it here. I'll I'll light. Uh, what a luxury shoot. We got somebody on lighting and. I am now the gaffer. Yeah, you are the gaffer. Who's the fluffer? <laughs> That's uh, wrong movie. Wrong kind of movie, Max. Wrong kind of movie, darn it. Man, I didn't realize we were getting into. You're talking about getting get. loud and. All right, Max, let's see it. Fire in the hole. That sounds like a Toyota V6. Put it in triple low. Yeah, only on the front. That's on purpose. Okay, let me see your sticks. Okay, yeah, that. This is what I remember being low, low. Yeah, that's low, low. Let's probably try something for something. Sounds like it's trying to die. Yeah. The hubs aren't locked, yeah. The hubs aren't locked. The hubs aren't locked. Still it's not. It's four. Oh, that, that was four. Okay, Max, hold up. You can drive off of this. Max. Yeah. Come forward like, uh, you know, cut him out six inches a foot. Just so we can strap. And then hold it there. Okay, okay, that's good. Uh, oh. have to stay on the, gas. the problem is you're gonna have to commit to it. Go, commit, commit, commit. Let's go, 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 go. Okay. Hold up. Yeah, now we need a winch. Let's do this again sometime. <laughs> yeah. Ideally not exactly this. It'll be my shit that's broken tomorrow. Oh, we're on that freaking fender. 
If that locker was working, it would dig and because that's what it's caught in right now is that ledge. I've, I've uh, dealt with a lot of stuck vehicles. This is the most stuck I think I've dealt with. Really? Stuck on a trailer, eh? Uh, yeah, I've never had a vehicle stuck on the trailer before. That's a new one. <laughs> That's working. Yeah. Come on, it's, it's trying to come up it. Yes. We got it off yep. the trailer. I mean, you had to do that anyway. <laughs> This is gonna be interesting, yanking the trailer out from under it. It's just one tire on it. It's science. <laughs> the tension is building. I'm gonna be so impressed with that truck. Okay, yeah. let me just take a quick look to make sure everything looks fine. That's fine. Oh, that's what that noise is. It's just on that tree there. Oh, you're gotcha. Good. Yeah. You good? Yeah, you're good. Let me walk you guys through what we're gonna do here. We got a Jeep Gladiator hooked up to a tree. The tree's got a pulley, the pulley's got a rope, and the rope's got a trailer. And uh, we're gonna try to... Yeah? The plan is to yoink it. Grease pull? Oh, let me, I got you, hang on. Try that. Okay. This is like a full video in itself. Yeah, I think you have a whole video here. I feel like it. Yeah, it's going. As soon as I get home, I'm getting a winch. At this point, does it? It almost looks like. It almost looks like my rear diff could might just slide past. How a little differently? Yeah, that way. That way, it's pulling. It's more from the tongue. If that worked, we're loosening it up. <laughs> we can try it for a boat. It's danger zone everywhere. <laughs> danger zone. Alrighty. Okay. Alright. Ooh, shit. Do anything? No. Not really. I think the problem is we're just fighting each other too much. Yeah. That's what it seems like. Let's try taking the Jeep off real fast. That was good. Do it again. So close. Well, yeah, it's just this big. There's just a big ass rut right here. So long okay, as the let's dish. get the winch attached to the truck now off of the cut or off the that, that, that setup. I think the front locker is gonna work. If it is, that's gonna be mint. Front's still not locked, but you're But that's I have plasma cutters and hammers. I gotta build some drive over ones. Anyway. Yeah, that's a, yeah, that's what you want with this kind of stuff anyway. Yeah. Just stay an extra day, we'll build some. Hell yeah. <laughs> uh, go ahead and pull forward just a little more so you're not on the edge and then uh God, I need to get a winch. She's 
tree, boys. Pull it down because get starting on the hill pulling the trailer is going to be Sounds worse good. than not. Huh? I'm surprised it takes that much effort. We've almost got the trailer out. It's hard to tell. Ethan, keep going. Keep going, yeah. Keep going, it's moving. Yep. There it is. Oh, sh <laughs> Okay. Well. That was something. We got it. We got the trailer, we got the Tacoma, got the Raptor. That was three recoveries in one night. Honestly impressed at my own incompetence. Thinking about it, like as we were like lifting on the trailer, we were realizing that that trailer, that new trailer of mine is pretty heavy. Like that Tacoma, although it's pretty lightweight, I mean, but the Tacoma and the trailer probably weighs as much as this little aluminum body V6 Raptor. I mean, Raptors, the, the second gen Raptors are pretty, uh, <laughs> they're pretty light, honestly. They're not the best tow vehicles, they really aren't. Wish I had aired down as soon as I hit this, uh, as soon as I hit this snow. You know what, if, I don't know when I'm gonna release this video, but I did do a video on this system where it has um, an inflate and deflate option with at the push of a button in the cab, which would be really, really cool. Would have saved me. Oh my gosh, I'm so jealous. Uh, Tyler and I wanted to buy this thing so bad. Oh, I can't believe they got it. 